What's up, everybody? It's Fuji, also known as Filthy, for really feeling naughty. Call me dirty. Today we're playing some Alluvium. Alluvium. Or Allu Alluvium, I think. I don't fucking know. I've always had a knack for seeing what's coming. Ooh. Goes with my line of work. Inspecting a dam or a bridge. You're looking for signs of failure years in advance. Man, this is fucking good. The bridge we were headed to, remote part of West Papua, that could wait 10 years for another experienced engineer. I but love the, I, love I don't foresee balance. everything. Is it stranded? Thirsty. Alright, well, I know anything. We have to... We can't drink camp water. The fruit tempts me. Plump berries. Heavy on the branches of the shrub. We tried them, of course. Grown drunk on them. They had that effect. Lowered inhibitions. Had us all giggling, dancing. But they Sounds did like nothing fun. to ease our hunger. Only made it worse. Okay, so that's not good. We need to find... Here, go over here. I literally like art solve anything. You literally have... If you have pixels in your fucking game, that just... You know... Fresh water? That's not, doesn't look like fresh water. Without this outflow drain, the dam could never hold the massive pressure that would build above it. I ensured we built it strong, but rubble and recycled plane wreckage is no substitute for reinforced concrete. Plus, it makes a convenient drinking fountain. Okay, drink it then. Cheers. I like this game. This game's pretty fucking awesome. Aha! Uh -huh. My pizza is here. Not with my bare hands. Alright, well, what... Okay, no, we, we know. Come on. I saw something over here. Bam, spear. Not with my bare hand. How do I accept, uh, get my spear? The trunk of the tree fern is wrapped in brown, hair-like fibers. I tear away a handful of the dry threads. Get no. It. How do I get my um spear? I don't look at the controls, so I just assume uh, palm. Been sleeping on the. Okay. How do I accept uh, get my spear? I hit like arrows or something. left click or something on it and then it gets me it's kind of difficult one two three not with my bare hands not with your bare hands give me a fucking speed you fucking wanker press with, like every button maybe it's like arrows one one two three four five signal fucking oh i have to i god damn it no yes I spear the fish on my second attempt. I'm getting better at this. Was that? There's not much left of the engine. Just one steel prop. I'd you need a prop. Okay, no one cares. There's a boat. Unbelieving. I stare at the ship chugging slowly across the horizon. There's a lump in my throat, as for the first time in weeks, the hope of rescue is rekindled. But, they won't see me. The fire. Oh God, the fire is out. I have to get it lit. They must see me. How do I get it lit? It's though? out. I peer right. closer. I need some tin. Tinder? Is that Tinder right there? Oh. I'd need tinder? appropriate tools to get it. Oh, palm threads. I nest the fibers in amongst the dying coals. What about palm branch? I fan the spark until it catches, and soon the fire is Jesus. roaring again. Jesus Christ, I'm a fucking genius at this. I look up at the eerie harmonic howl. One of those strange wild dogs. Damn, that You're welcome to that fish, my friend. 
As long as this boat sees my fire, I should be. The dog is on me in an instant. Rancid breath hot on my face as I struggle to keep its snapping teeth from my throat. Get them. Get them. I, I... It's burning well. I bat at the monster with the branch. In response, the beast leaps forward. Iron jaws close around my throat. I shake my head to clear the vision. No, I'm not trying that. Okay, got it. It's burning well. Oh wait, I got an idea. Palm branch of the fire. With my free hand, I hold the branch into the fire until it catches. Jesus, get. Burned. I drive the flaming brand into the beast's face. As it leaps back with a snarl, I hear that terrible howling all around me. I swing the branch around wildly, kicking at the sand with my heels as I back away from the circling dogs. I dash past the nearest dog. In response, the beast leaps forward. Iron jaws close around my throat. I... that wouldn't work. Think! That's a palm tree. There has to be something in the I ball. swing up the tree as the first dog Jesus darts Christ. in, snapping at my ankles. Jesus Christ. Save for a second, I remember the ship and look up. No, its course is unchanged. My fire now hidden to them by the rocks on the beach below. With desperation, I thrust the burning branch into the leaves above me and they explode into flame. With the howling of the dogs below me, and the furnace above already blistering the skin on my hands, I watch the ship sail slowly out of sight. I feel my grip weakening, and shut my eyes against the pain. Through my eyelids, the fire appears as an all-consuming wave of blood, washing it all away. I guess we're dead. Then I'm falling. Falling. I land hard. My eyes fly open at the sudden agony from my leg, and I look about me in wonder. The hammock I'd fallen from flaps against the bulkhead. My burned hand is bandaged, and my leg had evidently been set before I'd rebroken it just now. The pain has nothing to do with the tears that well in my eyes. Rescue. Gathering my will, I try to stand. Oh, the pain is too much. Ah, can't reach. Ah, can't reach. They must have removed my shoe. I throw my useless shoe at the mop and succeed in knocking it over. <laughs> Leaning over, I grab the mop. I snag the thin rope. I snap the mop handle over my good knee, then, biting one end of the rope against the pane, I bind the broken shaft to Man, my I'm leg. Smart. I'm sorry Crude for being complete, I carefully stand. I'm sorry for uh, being really silent. I just want you guys to hear this because this game looks fucking awesome and it's and they got a voice actor, so it's not cheap, you know. I wolf down the food, beetroot soup, still warm, mackerel, and crusty bread. A, I swallow two with water, no, vodka, from a tin cup, and pocket the rest. The pills leave me drowsy. I'll lie down and thank my rescuers later. I'm more like kidnappers. I wake to voices outside the door. Is this painkillers? Okay. I can hear shouting behind the door. Another language. Russian, perhaps? Yeah, we probably have. We're Hello? Probably kidnapped. Silence for a moment. Then the door is shoved open. You bet. On board is yet. I don't know. My God. Thank you. Thank you. A pizza. Food barely. Uh, pizza. I can't believe yeah. you found me. I, I'd given up. That can evil. I catch anger in his voice. Blinking away my tears, I see their faces for the first time. Faces red with rage. Do any of you speak English? My question cuts short as I'm shoved back onto my bad leg. Makeshift splint shattering. Lipsick. Please, I don't understand. 
Nirbudum said, Captain. Don't speak Russian. Dead behind us. Shocked, I stare at the gun shaking in the man's hand. I got this painkillers. No good. Myself, we come soon. No. I make a dive for the gun. I didn't. I see the man's. I see it all. Something else. I, I clicked on the fucking uh, splint. I grab the. Stand. I swipe at the pistol, knocking it clear. Frozen for a moment, we all eye the gun. No. I dive for the gun, beating the crewman to it by a split second. They fire at the man, and he staggers back. And they swarm. One grabs the gun. I hope. No. Not trying that. Alright, I got it. No. Shoot. I dash to the side. And they swore one grab. I sh that wouldn't That's work. Stupid. Think. Broken stick. I take another swing at the crewman. And they sh one grab. Okay. Something else. What else? Like there has to be. There's food. I got it. You use the stick to swipe the no. food at them. Wait, we shoot the food. No. Oh, okay. Oh, pipe! We shoot the pipe! God damn it, why didn't I look at this? Fire at the pipe, it ruptures, spewing a jet of hot exhaust. Coughing, the crewmen jump backwards. I stand, feeling the bones grinding in my leg, though dulled by the strong painkillers. Sealed. Not for long, baby. Shoot that way up. I shoot out the window and clear the remaining shards with the butt of the pistol. Then, Head spinning from the cocktail of pills and carbon monoxide, I plunge into the water. Baby, we escaped. Now I got hear the their screams in my head. The wet thud of blade biting into flesh. The snapping of bone. They break my leg. I see the red wave again. Washing it all away. I open my eyes. You're back here. No. Not back here. Dude, it's the best you're gonna fucking get. My god. The passage is open. Surprise he can fucking walk with a broken leg. Had they gone through? Yes, they is had. Is that why they attacked me? Go they on. must have. They must have seen the old campsite. Please! No! I was free! The blood! The bodies! The madness I left behind there! I can't go back! You fucking pussy. But I must! The crew of that boat! I have to stop them! I crawl through the fuselage and out the so cemetery. I guess, I guess of the he aircraft. killed all these people. Eat them. Victims. I guess I killed them. Guess uh, we had feet. Those sounds I shut out. They echo in my skull again. Shout, shut out. Oh, I thought I said shout. Screaming, laughing, cutting. God damn, he went nuts and killed everyone. A man walks towards me. By his shirt, I see it's the ship's captain. Wait! Stop! No. You can't be here! You monster. You killed them. I can explain. The berries. They... Shut up. I should kill you now. No. I... Please go. Before it's too... The thing lands on him, knocking him into the muck. There's a sickening crunch as the rock in its hands comes down on his head. She looks up. Smiling. Oh, it's a fucking <laughs> Ian! You came back. Anna! Oh god! Anna, stop! Okay, Anna, so I didn't Can't let it rot like the rest. Come, have some. There's plenty. <laughs> I turn and vomit noisily, shutting my eyes against the sight. I should never have left them. Holy shit. When they'd started on the pilot. 
I mean, he was dead already. But still, I'd had to leave. I couldn't watch them as they... God, I should have done something. Yeah, we're gonna do something right now. Oh, Ian, Ian. I always liked you, Ian. Come, sit with me. Ah, uh, nah, man. I have Thank to crazy. end this. Somehow. We got this. We're gonna end it right now. Put a gun through our fucking head. I take aim and pull the trigger. Nothing but a wet click. The gun is empty. Shit. <laughs> you want these? Pulling something from the jacket of the captain, she holds it up. A packet of rounds. Can I have that? Laughing, she tosses them behind her. Shit. Come and get them. <laughs> she returns her attention to the body. Okay, we're just gonna... No. There's no way to reach it. Alright. Painkillers. Give them to them. No. Alright. Tail section. Anna, please stop! <laughs> oh, Ian. Why should I stop? I feel great. You're eating humans. There's no way to reach it from this side of the dam. I just walk? Oh! To my dismay... I hear her howl echoed by two wild what dogs. What the fuck? Holy we run shit. up to her, and she tosses them some strips of flesh. Jesus Christ, Anna went fucking bonkers. <laughs> Aren't they wonderful? No. Oh. Holy shit. Okay, we're just gonna... Approaching, I gag on the oily smoke that bleeds out of the bonfire. There's no way to reach... Hey, the dog. dogs stare at me, as if I shudder. The same look is in Anna's eyes. She turned into a fucking wolf, there's yellow. Oh! The dogs howl with their master. Hackles up, I back off. It's not too late. We can still go back. <laughs> she titters at me, and I know it is too late for her. Maybe for me too. I don't think you ate people. She literally turned into a wolf. I can't even look at her. I won't touch the vo Okay, so that fruit uh, just made us all go bonkers. We'll shoot the dogs. I take aim and pull the trigger. Nothing. Okay, we already know that. Wait, painkillers. Throw them at the dog. I throw some painkillers at the mongrel. The dog ignores them. We'll leave and come back and see if that. Come dog. back, Ian. There's nowhere to go. You don't know that. There could be some ways to go. Oh, hey. Hey, doggy. Not taking. I got this. Hey, doggy, have some painkillers. I throw some painkillers at the mongrel. The dog ignores them. Ah, that's fucking bullshit. Rope. We'll take some rope. Not taking my chance. Okay, you're fucking pussy. So the situation is that they, they fucking crashed on the island. They ate some berries thinking that they were healthy, but apparently they're like some fucking crazy like drug berries or something made them all feel dancing and happy like drug berries. So then they fucking, I guess uh, they got really hungry so they started killing. They got real crazy and started eating each other. I think Eaton is, um, is innocent in all this, but you know. He got captured by the fucking Russians and almost were killed because he thought he... I noticed the pilot's helmet wedged under the tail of our plane. Right. I try, but fail to free it with my bare hands. Here we are. Clay, Cleaver. I take what's... I try to leave her. It's slick with blood and gore. I need some... We wash it in the water. Oh! We got enough fucking idea. We're gonna kill dogs. Get I doubt I could overpower them. You kill Anna then. I step towards her, weapon in hand. Oh! Those dogs will rip me apart. Jesus Christ, okay, we're gonna go. There's plenty for you. No, fuck out of here. I guess Ian may have been a cannibal, but we don't know that. I doubt sure. I could overpower Jesus Christ. Ian, you're such a fucking pussy. Just kill him. Ian, there's water right here. Clean it. This, like, literally makes no sense. Oh, wait. Cleaver. Palm tree. No. Okay, go fuck yourself, Ian. 
ruin all my creativity because I have literally no idea what you want. What you want, huh? Hey, we blow it up with a cleaver. Don't think so. You fucking pussy. No good. No. I, I, I can't. Wait a minute. Searching desperately for something. To my dismay, it comes away from the body. Oh, they're at the wild dog. I throw the hot. It splashes in the water. I search for another. I'm half relieved to find no. I search. I'm half relieved to find no more loose parts. Damn it. I search for another. I'm half relieved to find no more loose parts. Damn it, I wasted that. I could have easily used that on the other dog. I won't touch the vile fruit. I wasn't touching it. That's fruit? Oh, damn. Hey, well, uh... Chop up body parts. If I'm going to distract that dog, I'll need to... Oh, God, help me. I close my eyes and hack off a chunk of meat. That's it. That's it. I'm not fucking eating it. Alright. Hmm. So we need to somehow get the dog's attention. Maybe get the Dana. Don't think so. Okay. Because we can't throw it at that wild dog because no. one thing, it won't distract them. So we have to, let's go down here and kill this dog, see if we can do something about that. Come on, Ian. Don't let it go to waste. Shut up, you crazy bitch. I throw the horrid meat. Damn, I'm so fucking idiot. You put the fucking painkillers in the fruit. Or in the, uh, in the fucking body. I close my... There we are. I Fine. crush some painkillers. Throw it at the damn dog. Fucking idiot. I throw the horrid meat to the dog. So fucking idiot. It splashes in the water. Diluted by the water, the painkillers have no effect. Oh, you're a fucking pussy. Damn it. I thought that actually I worked. I search for another. I'm half for. Yeah, okay. We've gone off more parts. I close my eyes. Alright. I crush some painkillers and brush it into the meat. Give it to Anna. No. So. It can't. So we have to somehow get them out of the water. Here, we'll give it, this, give it to this dog. I throw the heart. Come on. Supposed to kill it, Ian. Be a real man. No. Cut the rope. Against my better judgment, I sever the rope. The dam shifts slightly, and I hold my breath. It settles, and after a quick survey, I'm confident it'll hold. Oh, so we have the rope now. Don't think so. Tie the dog. No. Uh, no. Okay. Well, Ian. No good. Okay. Ian, shut the fuck up. Alright, so we have rope. Oh, we have to tie it to the uh, to the flesh, and then we have to put painkillers in it, and then we uh, we get the I dog. I won't go. Are oh, you fucking idiot? You fucking idiot! I won't go carving up bodies for no reason. Oh, we used the rope to get the. Ammo. The rope wouldn't reach from here. If I could get onto the. Oh. No. No. Damn. Climb up. I gaze at the dam we built in the now. It may be ugly, if short-lived. Climb up it. Use a rope to climb. I fling the rope up to the top of the wall. Won't catch. Need some sort of hook. I got an idea. Cleaver. No good. You fucking idiot. The cleaver would make a perfect hook. Okay, so now we have to find some sort of hook. Maybe some bones, maybe. Ooh, a wrench. Prizing open cold finger. I unbolt the remaining prop. A long, flat bit of hot. Oh, okay, and we uh, use that and use this. No good. Okay. No. Okay, you're a fucking idiot. No. Don't think so. We got all these fucking parts. What the hell are we gonna use them for? Build a transformer? Oh, wait. Use this to get the helmet. I wedge the propeller in under the helmet and push down hard, bending the prop badly in the process. The helmet comes free, and I'm greeted by the remains of the pilot's head, grinning up at me from inside. Jesus. 
The hook catches near the top of the dam. I struggle up, blood now soaking the bandage of my burnt hand. Helmet. I secure the rope to the helmet's chin strap. Jesus Christ, how this the fuck does that- This could serve as a bucket if I had a well. Damn, I didn't really know I was that smart. I throw the helmet in behind the floating packet and start dragging it back towards me. I'm bringing the bucket up when I see Anna whirl around. I see what you're doing up there. Uh, she leaps cat-like up the embankment and I fall backward in surprise. Holy Her nails shit. sink into my leg like talons. You're back here. I kick it up. She drops me. I to keep my head kicking. strikes up. I come to only briefly. I see her standing up. I see it all in an instant. No, not trying that. Alright. Fog it up with that. I jam the hideous object deep into the drain. Almost immediately, I sense the pressure building behind. Jesus A terrible, surging power pushing inexorably on the wall. She pulls me upward, and I feel her hands close. The wall falls silent for a moment, then bursts. A red, a red wave. Washing it all away.